years of wear and tear on a vehicle can cause rubber and metal components in an AC system to develop leaks. These leaks allow the refrigerant to escape, causing the AC to blow warm air. But which part is leaking? This is where dye can be very helpful. Adding dye to the AC system makes locating the exact site of the leak easier. It's typically as easy as following the colored dye drip back to the part. The unique color of the dye, whether it's red or a UV dye, ensures you're not mistaking a fluid leak from one of the other systems in the vehicle. AC leak detector dyes come in many forms. Dyes can be injected into the system on their own, or they can be one of the many ingredients included in the recharge kit. No matter the product, always make sure to use leather gloves and protective glasses when adding UV dye to a system. Always read the product instructions carefully. In general, the product will be injected into the system through the low side port and then allowed to circulate through the system with the AC on max and the reventilating option on in your car. After 10 to 15 minutes or five miles of running the AC on full, you're ready to check for leaks. Pop the hood. For this portion, you'll need gloves and protective glasses, along with a UV light and UV glasses if UV dye was used. If a non-UV dye was used, a regular flashlight will suffice. There are several common areas AC systems tend to develop leaks. These include the compressor seal shaft, accumulator fittings, evaporator core, the expansion valve and or orifice tube and condenser, along with general hose connection points. Thoroughly inspect the entire system, following the high side around to the low side until you found the leak. Keep in mind that depending on the product you used, other additives may have already sealed the leak. Once you found the leak, assess the damage. If it's a large leak, you may want to take it to a trained technician. Thanks for choosing AC Pro as your expert in car AC systems. Be sure to check out all of our products at acprocold.com.